We're gonna try crappy Instagram ads so you don't have to. Wait, are they crappy? I don't know, maybe. Do you anything good? So, these are real ads that I got fed over the course of a few weeks. And you I bought like every ad that was sent to me. Well, I can tell you that your first purchase was a sound... <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> this Magikarp hat... That's it. That's It's a Magikarp hat. I'm so happy right now. I'm so happy. I mean, this looks like a legitimate, authentic product. It is quite high quality, and I will proceed to wear this for the rest of the video. That's why I put it first. Do you have any idea how much this cost us? I don't know. Uh, was it... $29.99? It was 27 plus 13 shipping. They got you on the shipping. 40 they bucks for this style? What more could you ask for? That that type of drip, you'd be making a real splash. The problem with getting these targeted ads on Instagram is as soon as you buy one type of something, it thinks you want a whole bunch of those. Are there Pokemon cards in the box? There's no Pokemon cards oh, in the box. I'm kidding. But I did find, I think that this is needs a new mascot. We have Robo Raptor X, but no one really likes Robo Raptor X. No. So that's why I present to you. <sighs> Matt, I don't like this. What is, what is this? What? My <laughs> Might I introduce you guys to Greg the Zombie, a.k.a. Rick. The beautiful thing about him is if you're oh reaching no. here, Oh, no. You can just kind of... Oh, his there's, heart. There's, there's a heart. Oh, good Lord. Oh, oh, cat got your tongue. But you know what else the cat's got? Get your filthy hands out of Greg. Here, just go ahead and grab, grab that. And just... <laughs> It just keeps going. How much is in here? <laughs> oh my goodness. He, he is deep. Feel, go, here, just. Do you want me to go deep? Yeah, go deep into, into Greg. Look at this. Here, wow. We'll just, we'll just uh, turn that around. Just If you could just. Uh, what am I doing? Ow. Ah. <laughs> this guy's fun. But the fun doesn't end there. It doesn't end here. What zombie is not complete without his brains? So his eyes just kind of go whoop, 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 whoop. Yeah. If you pop them. Ah. <laughs> Matt, do you think your brain is this big? No. <laughs> I know yours isn't. He's eating his own guts again. This is <laughs> Greg the zombie I can get on board with is the new This Is mascot. How much did we pay for Greg the zombie? 65. I'm going to leave one eye in because I think he looks funnier that way. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that brain is upside down. You're upside down, Matt. This video is sponsored by Govi Glide's Hexapro RGB IC Control. That might sound like a mouthful, Matt, but you know what you can get? You can get a beautiful array of 10 panels across your bedroom, your living room, your streaming room, and you can add some real style to your house. You can add up to 25 of these panels and individually control each side of the panels to create whatever patterns, colors, whatever you want for it. The cool thing about the Govi Glide Hexa Pros is that it's all controlled through the app. And you can even use some voice assistance, but it's really neat to be able to control everything from one spot and get the full RGBIC control of your dreams. It's super simple to install. There's no tools required and they can be arranged pretty much however you want on the wall. All you do is go check them out at the link in the description. Look, if you want to become the next ninja, Go and get the Govi Glide Hexa Pros. I don't think we can quite promise that, but what we can promise you I, is an incredibly stylish setup. If you go check out the link in the description, and BK, thank you to Govi for sponsoring this episode. Your future streaming career is not necessarily guaranteed. I guarantee it. Sometimes you and your significant other, you guys are, want to cuddle in for a night with Greg the Zombie, sure. but maybe you want some company. So... Is this the love button? The love button is definitely probably uh, required for this guy. Oh, no. Or should I say gal? Matt, is this what I think it is? <laughs> <laughs> just... Matt, do we need to censor this? Yeah. <laughs> Comes with leggings. You do need to dress it. Wait, let's look at that in the camera. Watch it jiggle. Can you please put pants on this? It smells weird. This company single-handedly- You smell the butt? Stop smelling the butt! Tips and tricks for the buttress pillow. Lay on the buttress with your head cradled between the thighs and beneath the cheeks, AKA the sweet spot. Are you- Take care of the butt and give her 
care and attention. Would it help if we if we labeled this as Austin? Yeah. Are you, did, like this this is actually a mold of your butt. I am this thick. I can confirm. For all slappers, squeezers, nappers, and face barriers, lounge on the couch, support your back while watching TV, gaming, and beyond. Look, you guys don't even need a girlfriend anymore. The yoga pants are machine washable to keep her smelling nice and scented. Can we, can we, can we, we stop with that? It did come with a couple extras, uh, a sticker that says, we heart butts. Okay, I can get down with that sticker. Everyone likes a good butt. <laughs> Sometimes you don't want to uh, just cuddle with roughly one-fifth of a person. We got you covered there too. Can I just say that this video has immediately started out maximum sus. So while this is your surrogate girlfriend, don't you, Bad Matt. don't you dare slap me with that pillow. This is the boyfriend pillow. Look, sometimes <laughs> you just need a cuddle, right? I think everyone needs a cuddle in life. And if your butt isn't doing the job, your boyfriend pillow certainly will. So yeah. if you have a hobby of wanting to create a human being like I do, I have roughly three fifths of a human here. So hang on, so we're gonna go. This is the boyfriend buttress <laughs> pillow complete. I bet you that I'm the only person who has bought this pillow that does not play League of Legends. <laughs> <laughs> you remember when we used to have a tech channel, Matt? How much do you think we spent on the buttress pillow? Sixty nine ninety five. That would have been a great price. Unfortunately, we did not. It was ninety dollars, but it was thirty percent off. So the original price is one hundred and thirty dollars for roughly seventy orders of chicken nuggies. You two Inflation can have like thirty orders. Chicken nuggies. Expensive. One fifth of a girlfriend. So we're all cuddled up with our boyfriend pillow and yep. our, our buttress pillow. Yep. We're ready for bed. I'm ready. But how do we go to bed? We all, you know, here's something I have for you and your son to enjoy both at the same time. Baby shirt, do 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 do. Baby shirt, do 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 do. Baby shirt, do 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 do. Baby shirt. This doesn't have any words on it, but the illustrations are on point. That shark is in fact sharding deep in the ocean blue, where the lights fade and it grows dark. There lived a wonderful big fish family with a little baby shark. Well, sharks aren't fish. Does he shart yet or no? The shark loved, I'm gonna skip to the part where he sharts. His tummy made a gurgle and a grumble too. He felt something moving through him and he did not know what to do. Even in the quiet ocean, a loud poof could be heard. A blink came out of his bum. Come on, you know the word. <laughs> you notice that there are a number of other farting adventures, including Gus the Gassy Ghost, Frank the Farting Flamingo, or Foxy the Fox's 4th of July fireworks farts. Look at that and try to tell me that's not a little sus. That is a furry. The eyes are what make it so much more sus. Like, it wants to be farting right now. Matt, yeah. please rescue me. Please rescue this video. Can we move on? Look, I know sometimes it's hard, so I got you this. Memo bottle, an A5 25 ounce bottle. The whole gimmick of this is that it's just a big clear bottle. This is it? This is the whole thing? Not quite the whole thing because I splurged and got the full starter kit. No, no, it actually goes. Uh, so. The idea is that this is small enough uh, to fit you into your bag. Toss your iPad and laptop out of your bag because the memo bottle can come. Fill up your Janko jeans with this guy. Wait, does this fit in my? <laughs> How much do you think we paid for this? If you pay more than thirty dollars, I will be offended. Forty-five. That's a lot of money for what a weird little bottle that is. What? Why does it need a stand? What kind of water bottle needs its own stand? It doesn't. Holding 750 milliliters, the A5 Memo Bottle is a reusable water bottle for the premium drinker. Get yo cheap ass alcohol out of here. You can only drink Blue Label out of the A5. It suggests glug, 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 glug. to add a vitamin boost to every sip by placing a few blueberries or strawberries inside. You're gonna tell me a fucking <laughs> strawberry is gonna fit through that hole? <laughs> a blueberry, sure, but a raspberry? Absolutely not. I refuse to take part in the rest of this video. I'm just gonna hide behind my completely transparent clear flask. Um, those who refuse to take place 
don't get to be oh, magic spooners. Spoon. So do you love cereal but hate flavor? As I completely stop us from ever getting a sponsorship to this particular brand. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> so I'll die. Are you like this? You can't chug milk. What are you talking about? If you chug milk, milk you'll die. <laughs> How are you supposed to die from chugging milk? <laughs> Matt, save some for the cereal. Oh, it's actually really good. The real reason I splurged for this kit was for this. Ah! The limited edition bowl and spoon. I'm pretty sure that's the same bowl that your kid uses, but it's got a bird in it. It smells like cereal already. Look at this spoon. Oh, that's a cool spoon. I could spoon with this all day. The idea with Magic Spoon is that it is very expensive, like triple what a normal box of cereal costs. It's very expensive, but it's got no sugar, it more is protein. Keto-friendly, gluten-free, grain-free, soy-free, wheat-free, naturally flavored, totally delicious, childlike cereal for grown-ups. Are you a cereal, like aficionado? No, I actually have not had, I don't do cereal very often. I usually eat a PB and J in the morning. You're gonna spill, you're gonna spill. Spilled all over the place. Give me a review, Matt. It's not bad, but it's not good. This is so expensive. Like, I mean, again, cereal should cost what? Three bucks for a big box? And this is like, I think you buy individuals like $8 for a small box. Like it is, it's a lot. It's got a weird aftertaste. But like, I would eat this. I wouldn't pay for it, but I would eat this. How much did we pay for this starter kit? For six boxes of cereal and, and a, bowl. a bowl and a spoon. $69. Over $10 nice. per box. Look, if you want to go and buy yourself some magic spoon based on Instagram ad, by all means, go for it. That looks nefariously blank. So we live in California where we know that the weather is just all over the place. Instagram thought, look, I need to know what the weather is. And how would you Hot. ever know? Hot. How would you ever know what the weather is? Go outside. It's hot. I'm a true gamer and I don't compromise. So I don't go outside. Instead, we have storm glass. What? It's its own ecosystem. I don't get it. I'm just looking at the, it looks to be a bunch of like little crystals inside a glass. Well, it's so it looks nice. Oh, kinsey has got to clean that up. It's snowing. So the idea with this thing that doesn't clearly work is that there is an atmosphere in here. Oh my God. Look. A little crumbly. Walk me through what this storm glass is supposed to do. So it's an atmosphere in a glass, which means that it rains, thunders, hails. If it was cloudy and whatnot, the pressure in here would simulate like a cloudy rainstorm in here. And this thing actually works. No, there's like zero positive reviews on this thing. How, how, how much was it, Matt? Uh, $35. At least looks nice on the it's desk. It's kind of neat looking. I, I don't get it though. Do you want to drink it? Don't drink it. All right, last but not least. I'm covered in styrofoam. Well, first things first. Hey, I already did a video on this. What was that video par a part of? That was testing YouTube sponsor scams. So Gravistar, the company who makes these serious gaming earbuds, have reached out on numerous occasions offering to sponsor a video. And as part of this video, I decided to take a look at a lot of these potential sponsors to see if they were in fact scams or legit. And with these, I found that while I did purchase them with our own money, they weren't amazing, but for the money, which I think is like 130, 150 bucks or something. Well, I find it hilarious that you put it in the uh, scams video because I've been trying to return these for two weeks and <laughs> they won't take them back. Well, they have emailed us several times about sending some. They have been less than responsive about taking them back. I don't want to end it there. That's boring. Let me introduce you to Rick. The Mozart Bluetooth speaker. I call him Rick. It's just Bluetooth speaker. I don't know. What, what would make you say that? This looks like a pop gone wrong. <laughs> That's exactly what I described it as. I hey, have Claire. a feeling that we are the, like, we're the sole reason that any of these companies exist. It's just YouTubers buying this stuff to talk about how weird it is. He looks so sad. Yeah, because you wasted a hundred dollars on him. Oh wait, actually no, I know what you're about to do. The speaker's only on one side. This whole thing is one speaker on the side. That's it. How much was this? 
That is a $10 Bluetooth speaker and a horrifically That is ugly. $400 in just art alone. You stuff him inside Rick. And we ever have to look at the stupid speaker again. Rick hungry. He'll just hold that and then we'll just uh This is This is almost worse. Matt, do we can you please sum up this video? What exactly do we find here? I'd love to say that we got scammed. You can't get scammed if you're the one who is scamming themselves. Something I've learned far too many times. Oh, okay. Well, we're going to do that, huh? I hate to say it that this is actually this is a really comfy pillow. Matt, are you going to take the butt home? I'm definitely taking the butt home. Are you going to snuggle with the butt tonight? Why wouldn't I?